in the state of Illinois in 2010 when you've got the president uh, talking about sending Gitmo prisoners to the land of Lincoln. Yeah, well, you know, this is after uh, he tried Kansas and tried uh, Michigan, and uh, now he's coming back to his home state. And um, I would say it's not any pop more popular there. Uh, the, the Congress has voted on a number of occasions to uh, stop appropriations, stop federal funds to close You're against Gitmo. It. I'm against it. I had the chance to uh, visit Gitmo in May, and quite frankly, despite all of the bad press, was very Im in impressed with the facility. Is it a national security risk, though? Is it a Sending Gitmo prisoners to Illinois, is that a, a threat to the people of that state, of your state? Well, let's back up. Why are in Gitmo? Uh, it's because of the perception uh, of that detention facility, uh, of, of a detention facility. Um, I would suggest to you that uh, moving Gitmo from, uh, from Cuba to Illinois uh, does not do away with the problem of detaining these criminals. And more importantly, the question of where they should be tried is extremely unpopular with the American people. Uh, they want them tried in military courts, not in civilian courts here in, in U.S. soil. Gene? Well, I, you know, I've written about this. So I happen to think it was the right thing to do to, yeah. to, to close Guantanamo, uh, precisely because of that, because I think it was, it was uh, acting against U.S. interests around the world. The perception. The perception, but perception counts. And yeah. and Guantanamo had come to be, be be shorthand for Abu Ghraib for the for the occupation of Iraq and and the war in Afghanistan and everything else. Yeah. Uh, and and this perceived war against Muslims. The whole like, yeah. Guantanamo came to symbolize a lot. I think it was right to shut. You know, down. Bob, uh, the congressman wasn't even born. Uh. Jimmy Carter talked then young governor Bill Clinton into taking detainees from Cuba. Yes, that's Did right. Did not end well for Bill, uh, for, uh, Bill Clinton. Well, that's true, but you, the, the question was an important one. Is it a national security threat to move those prisoners to Illinois? Well, um, look, I, I don't believe it's a good idea whether it's moved to Illinois, Michigan, or uh, or Kansas. And You're deflecting the is question. Is it a national Earthly. security threat? Uh, because it actually well, creates a lot security. of jobs. Would the villain yeah. would be less safe? Because you'd be opting well, out on the opportunity to create a good number of jobs. Yeah, look, I'm not going to I'm not gonna fear my and say, look, there's going to be a tax in Illinois if this is moved. I would say it's an unnecessary threat to move uh, 100 to 200 known uh, uh, terrorists to the United States soil. Right now, they're on an island where no one can reach them, um, and moving them to uh, the Midwest right. uh, of our country isn't necessary. Congressman, you're obviously still young and naive. Fear-mongering, a wonderful <laughs> thing. <to call laughs> yeah, right. right.